Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pastiche of Skin. Today we are doing a cold open for a game called Lethal League. Uh, Lethal League. Have you ever heard of Lethal League? No, but I've heard of Lethal Weapons, so if it's anything like that, I should be fine. Well, you make use of Lethal Weapons in Lethal League, but it's actually <laughs> a, essentially, don't you press buttons, I didn't do anything. stop pressing buttons. Didn't do anything. So Lethal League is essentially um, the world's most modern version of Pong. So this is going to be like really dodgy. Oh, well, I see the tiny not, clip of you playing at all. this. What? I've seen a tiny clip of you playing this, but I haven't actually played it myself. Yeah, the um, essentially what it is, um, you've got multiple competitors in an arena and you don't hit each other. You hit the ball. Right. And the ball has to bounce around and then you essentially like play pong back and forth, trying to score points or knock the other person out by hitting them with the ball. Sweet, sweet, sweet. I need to turn the audio back on again because I had the audio turned off on this earlier on. Wait for it. There we okay, go. Okay, it didn't deafen us. That's the main thing. Oh, I was prepared. <laughs> I don't worry. I was covered for this. Uh, so see, grand. So all the defaults, everything loaded in, and we're ready to rock and roll. Now, where did you get this? Was this on... Uh... This is on the PSN network. Uh, P it's available on the American PSN at the moment. It hasn't been released on a European networks yet, but it has been available on PC on Steam for a long time now. It's actually, it's on my, it's been on my wish list for so long that um, it's one of those games that I, every single time I see it drop in price, it's like, I want a copy, I want a copy. But I, uh, the developers behind the game actually got in touch and sent us a code for the game to try out for ourselves. Oh, sweet. Yeah. So let's see, characters, we've got, uh, who's that? Raptor. Raptor. We've got uh, Switch, who's a funky sort of son of Bender. <laughs> yeah, it's a <laughs> funky droid bot. Droid bot. Uh, Candyman. Candyman can. Dice. We've got Latch. We have uh, Sonata. 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 See, so it's not the Japanese as Sonata, as in like a song of Sonata. I'm of course going to pick the robot. And I'm picking the Asian chick. Just going through the different colors variations here as well. Uh, there can, we go. Uh, make it a green. Make it as Irish possible. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to rock and roll? Ready to rock and so roll. So basically controls for this man. Uh, X is jump. Right. Square is hit. Sure. Circle is to bunt. They can't like just like stop the ball. It doesn't like knock it anywhere. It just like... Stops you, it stops it from hitting you. It's essentially it's like a defend but it, or deflect. Okay, cool. And um, yeah, that's it. That's all you need. Really, three buttons. Sweet. Oh, and try. I, I've already forgotten all of that. F <laughs> you've forgotten three <laughs> buttons. I'll pick it up as we go. I'll pick it as we go. And triangle is taunt. Long time watchers of this will know I am just shit at games. All right, let's rock and or roll. Or paying attention. So we have it. This is one on one, but normally it's actually up to four players in a match. Yeah. Did I just went? Yep, you did. Oh, fucking ass. Yep. Yep. Wipeout! <laughs> Wipeout. Yep. Wipeout, dude! Totally spectacular. Gnarly! You're attacking with a skateboard for fuck's sake. <laughs> Take that, bitch. <laughs> Take out your I'm trying to give it some for you so you can actually get to the ball. You're actually kind of like a Harley Quinn sort of ask. Yeah, mallet user. Mallet, uh, oh, boom! Excellent. Didn't see you hitting that. It's kind of got a Streets of Rage sort of vibe to it. Yep. Almost like, oh, the, streets, the, shit. Almost like the fight mode in Streets of Rage. You know, like oh. where you could fight against each other, or the way you had to finish the match if you chose to be on the opposite team. Streets of Rage had a fight mode against each other. Yeah, ah, versus mode. I don't remember that at all. Oh well, the versus mode was in from Streets of Rage. Uh, Three, I think, but in the fir end of the first game, if you chose to join the bad guy, you had to fight each other. Yeah. Boom! Nice. Ah. You're starting ass. to get the rhythm of it now. Yep. Rhythm of the night. Ah! I jumped <laughs> right into that one. <laughs> Woo! Is there any taunts? <laughs> yeah, triangle, I told you. Oh. So I've been using the other buttons. Just enjoy myself. Boom. Ah! See, I've got you on my side. That's why I picked the skateboard. <laughs> yeah. ah. And then, like you, if I have overconfidence as well. <laughs> <laughs> ah, fuck. Thought I had that one. Wasn't too far off. It's not a bad game. This actually is kind of addictive. It reminds me of the... Uh, what was the game we were playing the other week? The dice, uh, the disc game. The what game? Oh, uh, disc jam. Disc jam, yeah. Disc yeah. jam is like pong as well. Yeah, well, yeah. Disc, disc jam definitely like pong. It's it's just the fact that it's essentially potentially made to look like wind jammers. Mm. 
which um, was an old Neo Geo game, which is getting released soon on the PlayStation Network as well. From uh, Dot Emu is the name of the company that's doing the port of it. Oh, <laughs> You'll let me build up speed, man. You might not want to let me do that. Damn it. <laughs> I gotta bunt that fucking ball into your cerebral cortex. What the shit? I bounced it off the wall just as you hit it. <sighs> pew 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 pew! <laughs> uh. Oh, there you go. Have fun with that. <laughs> you give yourself no plenty of time to try and build, the, build up the speed in that. Ah! <laughs> See, this is something I do against the computer. I jump around, I jump and then attack it from the opposite side so it actually continues on the same path without them noticing. But it doesn't really work Bastard. against players. No. Sort of. Yep. Oh, come on. I was bunting that. <laughs> Fucking... If you hold down Pew! your attack button as well, it actually picks up the speed. Oh, yeah, uh, all right. Don't, don't, tell me how to, don't, don't tell me how to defeat you. I mean, I've already done that once. <laughs> Again, you've overconfidence. Bastard. Weapon! Tubular, man! Like, oh my god! Is anybody got pizza? Ah! I was doing a really good impression of Michelangelo, <laughs> no? Yeah, yeah, you were doing a great impression of Michelangelo, but sadly not doing a very good impression, impression of, uh, of, somebody of a winner. Somebody, yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Big talk come from a loser. Oh, well, that's one all now. One that's all, a, I, like, I was I was giving you like the opening round so that you get your say. Oh, that's bullshit. That is absolute bullshit. <laughs> I hope anyone watching this knows that's bullshit too. Play ball. Ah, oh, fucking now I feel bad for you, so I'm letting you win. <laughs> See, I can't hit it whenever it's got that shit. I know. It. I, I thought I'd fuck around with you, but ah, oh, what the shit. Fuck die, you redhead bitch. Ah, couldn't react fast enough. Pew pew. <laughs> ah! <laughs> couldn't tell where that was coming from. It's a devious game. Jesus Christ. Ah, no. Fucking bastard. Damn it, that just touched my toe. <laughs> Which is more than enough to, to kill you? Apparently so. Uh, what the fuck was that about? What we said at the same time? Yeah, probably. Right last. <laughs> Bastard. No, I hit that one though. Do you also notice that you know where that game comes from at the end? No. It's actually a reference to... Oh, cool. We actually got a different character, colored character. The uh, That's actually Man. from Smash Brothers. All right, cool. Well, that's not that cool. That's like proper... That's proper nerd stuff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 what? <laughs> they, Fucking nerd. They didn't steal assets, but they made their own <laughs> assets, but just happened to look identical to the Smash Brothers one. Even with the same guy going, Game! Game over. Um, do you want to try a different mode, or do you want to try... Try a different mode. I mean, it's an addictive game. I'm actually kind of getting into it now. <laughs> so essentially, whenever you pick your uh, character, uh, uh, hang on. Uh, gonna... stay away from that ah! one. There we go. You have four players. Well, you can put four players. But what I was going to say is, we can play um, team or strikers. So Ooh. team is actually whenever you have um, scores essentially on each team, right. and the last man standing wins. The last team standing wins. Oh, okay. Strikers has a net on either end of the room. Right. And you have to actually score into the net. Like basketball? Yeah, essentially. Okay. See, that time I followed. Mm -hmm. I didn't. Last time, I buttons didn't even know. Do you want to play a bit of basketball, like me versus you, just one-on-one? -on -one? Yeah, we'll try a bit of basketball first. All right, cool. You can put on different balls in this, but I think you have to actually complete the challenge mode in it to actually be able to get all the balls or play uh, long enough to actually level yourself up. Play ball! Oh, so... Ah... Uh, Scored. Fucker. Ah! Oh! Ah! Hey! 
I thought I was going to get that whenever he hit it, but... It Fastball, Johnny! <laughs> Ah, just, I'm just in a league of my own, like Madonna and Rosie O'Donnell. That was a great fucking movie. <laughs> it was a great movie. It was a really good movie. It's underrated. Tom Hanks as well. Is he, oh, fuck, he was in that film? Yeah, he was uh, played the manager who didn't believe in them. Damn. Boom, what do you think of that one? <laughs> that was kind of fast. Too fast. It's almost, it's almost fast and somewhat furious. <laughs> Whack that son of a bitch! Ah, fuck. <laughs> ah! Boom! Off bitch, your own net, get man. out the way! Get out the way, bitch! Get out the way! Loved using that in D&D the other night. <laughs> fuck! Ah, <laughs> you fuck. The best entertainment of actually kicking your ass. Here comes the boom! How are you jumping so goddamn tall? Double jump? Oh, double. God damn it. Yeah, I realized it after I'd asked. Yeah. Oh, shit! Shit! Shit, 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 get, get, get it! Oh, come on! <laughs> Fuck the way off. <laughs> yeah, her. You know, actually, my double jump doesn't work. Some characters don't have double jumps. Bastard. But you, I think you can move faster. You can actually, like, double tap to dash. And put on your skateboard. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, Thank you. <laughs> Just gave me that ass point. <laughs> you're, you're welcome. <laughs> Red so, wins again. Yeah. Suck it, blue. Suck it. Red versus blue. Yep. Great, great, uh, web great series. Team, great web series. The guys from Mr. Teeth. Yeah. Um, do you, want, do you want to try to see if we can actually find a match online? Two of us versus uh, somebody else? Us versus the world, baby. Yep, us versus Make the goddamn world. Us versus the world. Now, this could and may take a moment or two. Ah, well, we can just sit and vamp over the top of it and talk about the game and, and how, and how we feel about it and what we thought about the game and whatever else. Um, I've played a few hours of this and tried to complete the challenge mode. Uh, oh, can you not join in? Apparently not. Apparently it's only on online? What? Well, I'm going to invite you in. No, You're going to try and invite me? Okay. I don't think you can actually do two players in one place, but I'm going to try it. Are you even listed? Are go you over, logged in? Go over to your list. Of, and then uh should be ones that are online. Yeah, that's... Well, yeah, that'd be the, the blue ones in here are the ones that are options, online. Let's go to options menu. Maybe it'll sort by online. online. Damn. <laughs> A lot of There's just a lot online. of people I know are online, man. <laughs> Way, <there laughs> I was going to say, like, you're just like, oh, yeah, let's uh, choose the ones that are online. Like, dude, I have a lot of people who are online all the time. Uh, so you won't be able to join. You'll be, you'll essentially try to loot me uh, out of the game. To open a game. Out, so uh, so uh, I can't. Player. Well, let's see if we can actually find a match online. Uh, the, that's uh, that's one of the biggest problems about uh, playing games. That are um, multiplayer in person. We can have four people playing here right now. Yeah, we can have four player playing in this studio. But then we, we can't have, take those four people online. But whenever we go online, we can't actually do that four people online. But the also problem is that this game hasn't come out over here yet. Ah, but then there could. Well, no, that shouldn't be an issue. You know what? Shouldn't be an issue with online. With online, well, no, there's there is like server divisions. Yes. Oh yeah. No, no. I mean that's fine. Servers are grand. You have your server in London. You have your server in fucking yeah, Canada. But, no, but the East ping, America, the, the ping limitation would actually stop Americans. But you should still be able to have two or three people going online from the one console. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, most games should actually have that built into them nowadays, but um, sadly, it's not the case. This jam who, who made, who made the made choice of actually game? allowing you to do that with two players, so you'd actually be able to play doubles on one console and that kind of crap. Yeah. That was actually a very smart move in their part. This game doesn't have that. No. No, it... I that's think that one big flaw I don't like about this game. Part, that's actually probably the only flaw. Part I of the reason why it could game. very well be from its actual lineage as being a PC game first. Mm. Because how many people play multiplayer on a PC? No one. Yeah, no one. You don't have... It's not that often. Unless no. a game was designed to be couch co-op and you get... Because most people will only have one control pad plugged into their goddamn PC or connected to it anyway. Oh, yeah. So it's just one of those things that just doesn't happen as often. But the, um, the character choices in this game... The uh, aesthetic of it actually making it look like a look like a Smash Brothers game. Uh, very simple mechanics of just being able to attack and uh, retaliate. They should make a DLC for this where you can 
change it to the like a 16-bit version so it does look like Streets of Rage. <laughs> it's actually over the top of it? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Ah, come on. It'd be, you know, nostalgia or something. Like, how, how old is Streets of Rage? Streets of, well, that, that's the thing, right? Sega have announced that they're trying to bring back some of their classic art IP. Mm. So there's a possibility at E3 they might announce a new Streets of Rage, a new Panzer Dragoon, a new whatever the hell they're going to be doing next. But they, they have intended to announce some new games in the series. Is of, this um, a one player? Uh, well, or this is training. Mode? I wanted to demonstrate something to you in training. Now, see the number in the center of the screen at the bottom? Yeah, 38. And let's see what happens whenever I hit it again. Yeah? Yep. Keep watching. Ten thousand? Are we gonna go Super Saiyan? Saiyan? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, sure. Okay. At some point I'm expecting to bring back uh, Lois Lane from dead. Or bring her back from, from the dead. Jesus Christ. Super Saiyan! Getting there, we're getting there. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I love that you can't hit any, you can't hit it any much harder than one at a time at, at, at this point. It should be better than this. Really? Yeah, I managed to I managed to get it up to like twenty thousand. There, there we, we go. go. Super Saiyan. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So she's starting to fucking sort of lag. Not even lag, but like she's got an after trail around she's her. An after trail. Oh, it's the Flash. Yep. Kid Flash. No, not Kid Flash. Jesse Flash. Uh, okay. <laughs> don't don't go breaking the game now. Yep. You can't get any faster than that? Yep, I can't. So, if you're actually Jesus. playing this with uh, multiple players... <laughs> if you're playing this with multiple players, I'm just gonna go blind. <laughs> this, is the, this is the reason why I want to play against people who might be playing this online. That actually might be this good, to be able to get a rally of the ball back and forth until you're fighting in this room. But, there, see, there's the problem. With that is, you can't make it a goal thing, or like a... Like a basketball or whatever. Yeah. Because you would hit the you would hit the gold. You can't make it so the person dies, because then you wouldn't get it fast enough to get it up to this. Yeah. You would hit someone. The only time you ever get to see this is in training mode. I mean, I guess you could like hit it at the top if you could somehow hit it diagonally all the, in the same you place like and have them stood in those places. That is it. Since you just doing this over and over again. Yeah. If you could do that, then you could do it, or slightly higher, so it doesn't decapitate them. Yep. Hmm. That's pretty much it. But yep, that's, uh, I wanted I, to show that before we uh, finish all of our experience <laughs> of... It's a lot of good way to end it, goddamn thing, anyway. Yeah, essentially we can just end it on this, <laughs> with, um, the chaos that actually <laughs> would be happening on screen. <laughs> I love this. I can good wait for it. God. Is this the fact that you can actually play keepy uppy with it? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. At this point... Um, so, do you think I might have had a little bit too much time playing this one? Yes. <laughs> yesterday? Pastige Derm. Pastige's <laughs> skin here, Derm, has played this way too much. <laughs> no wonder I didn't stand a fucking chance playing it earlier on. Alright, so, uh, yeah. Lethal League. Great goddamn fun. Um, very, I, I, it could be very addictive. I feel like it's unbelievably right. addictive. Uh, if you get about four, three or four friends around, and you can actually sit down and play this as couch co-op, you'll be at it for hours, just playing through uh, a number of matches, just watching oh, yeah. each other get ridiculously messed up. Um, this is really good fun. I hope to actually. I hope whenever we actually have a games night, we can actually get a couple of people in and get a, a decent four player controllers game that's coming up soon. So. Set it up, yeah. Yeah, that, that, this is one of those games that needs to be it needs to be played four player to actually just for the amount of abuse that you'll shout at each other <laughs> while you're playing. <laughs> Especially if it's actually two on two, because they'll always be like, "Why did you miss that one?" <laughs> well, if so, we're doing that. I'm bringing my con I'm bringing my PS4 over, and we've got two TVs. You can f have two against two. Well, you can definitely play online then. 
Well, yeah, definitely. Well, no, you'd only be able to play two player one v one online essentially because it'd we'll be one, person, one person per console. We'll kicks all the people's asses online. Yeah. So, like, say, well, I mean, that'll only happen after the game, of course, officially releases in the UK. Well, that's true. Fair enough. So, um, yeah, guys, uh, this is a game that's well worth checking out. Uh, I think a co as a cold open episode, it's good to actually get a game every once in a while that you just really goddamn enjoy. This has been Lethal League, and I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you thought it, enjoyed our opinions, enjoyed our gameplay, and actually wanted to see more stuff like this on a weekly basis on the channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button up there at the top. It'll allow you to actually see anything and get notifications of whenever new videos come up here on the channels. And, of course, if you don't want to do that, you can still easily find me at any time just by searching for Pastiche of Skin. Just type in that name anywhere onto Google, onto Bing, onto DuckDuckGo, or do, does Ask Jeeves and Excite still exist? Do we have any other search engines other than those couple ones? You can do Bing, you've got Google, you've got DuckDuckGo. What else H is there? Huli. Huli. We've got Huli, Huli. Chat. Huli use, search. Use Huli chat. Um, <laughs> you've been watching uh, way too much community. Uh, no, it's not community. It's um, Silicon Valley. Silicon Valley, yeah. That's a great goddamn show. Um, so, yeah, you can search for us easily on Passive Skin. We're not hiding anywhere. It's easy to find me. And, of course, you can always find at Real Will Combi at uh, any of his sources, Twitter, yep. Instagram, and anything else as well. Now, if you're watching this on YouTube, there'll be three boxes appearing up over the top of my head. The one here will actually be for other episodes of Cold Open, where you can go back and look at other games that we've looked at really quickly here on the channel. You've also got over the far side, the most recent videos that have been released here on the channel. And right over the top of Hit's face is pretty much a video that was designed for you. That was actually based on the Google Analytics and chose a video on my channel that you should like. So I'd recommend hitting that link right there. So thank you very much for watching. And I will see all you dudes in the next video. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.